It is true that today uh, I was banned uh, by Twitter <laughs> for uh, 12 hours, although it wound up being for about 45 minutes. This was for the best reason. Yeah, yeah, I was banned because Daily Wire's uh, uh, senior editor, Emily Zanotti, uh, <laughs> made the biggest fake news tweet of 2018, uh, coming in like right down to the wire on the 31st. She said that the best recipe for Brussels sprouts, if you've, maybe you grew up uh, not liking to eat vegetables, the best recipe for Brussels sprouts is something with olive oil and butter and honey and... The, honey and the disgusting. Yeah. The disgusting. Brussels sprouts are disgusting. I retorted that the, uh, an even better recipe for Brussels sprouts, a little salt, a little pepper, a dash of paprika, mm. then you do a splash of Worcestershire shot sauce, uh, you brown a little bacon in a mm. cast iron skillet, yeah. then you throw it all away and sear your face off <laughs> because that would be better than eating Brussels sprouts. That sounds, that's fair to me. Yeah, I, wake exactly. up, I wake up this morning with, with an alert from Twitter saying, I'm not kidding, that there are people in this world who care about me and that mm. I am not alone. Uh, and a link to a suicide hotline because no. uh, because they had determined that I was a, uh, a danger mm. to myself uh, and was advocating people harm themselves uh, over this tweet. Now, I've always I've always felt you were a danger to others, yeah. but I've never felt you're a danger to yourself. Yeah, absolutely to others. Are you kidding me? Have you ever seen me in a kitchen? It's just, 